Yes, I just styled my septum stack. Yes, I decided to do it again, still feeling out what I like best. And I decided that I wanted to try something a little bit more simple. I planned out what I'm going to do in my last video. And now I'm just going to go for it and start putting them in. I do have an ear skin in my nose that is six gauge. So it makes a little tunnel that I can just put all these in there. This is a 16 gauge man in the moon clicker from Cutland Jewelry. Um, you can find a lot of these in my showcase. Okay, there is number one. It is really cute all on its own. Next up is this chunky clicker from Out for Body Jewelry in 16 gauge. I really love the way that these two stack together. I'm gonna try this Cutlin floral piece. I don't really know what it's called. I'm gonna try this floral one in a larger diameter. I have an eight and a 10. I'm wearing the eight right now but I want it to hang down a little bit further. You see how shiny it is? I love that, but it's definitely too big. So I'm gonna go back to the eight. I'm just gonna try some of those simple clickers in front of it. This one is 16 gauge, but I don't remember the diameter. I wanna say it's probably eight millimeters. Okay. Maybe I'm gonna try putting the next one in front of it just to see how it feels. This one is 18 gauge, eight or seven millimeter. It's not really giving the effect that I want. So I think I'm gonna try switching out those two front rings for maybe one 14 gauge ring. The only 14 gauge ring I have is too large of a diameter. So let me play around for a minute. Here's one look that I landed on. It doesn't really complement my face in that simple elegant way I was looking for, but it's kind of cool. It's got a little star from Cutlin in the back, the moon, the chunky one, and then my little heart sequence clicker. Um, I mean, it's cute. It's definitely not what I'm looking for, so I'm going to try again. 